Today, I'm going to play at the new club that I've just joined for the first time. This club's got a heated star table. Q schools matches are all played on heated star tables. I'm thinking this is probably where I'm going to do the majority of my preparation leading up to Q school. It's not too far away from me. The guys there seem really, really welcoming, really accommodating. It's going to be interesting to see how long it takes my game to get to a good enough level, I think, to actually justify entering Q school. My outlook on Q school is unless you've put the preparation in, unless you've given it everything and you've put in the graft, I don't think you should really enter. Don't get me wrong, you get people entering just for the fun of it. They just want to turn up, they've got the money, their commitments allow them to do this. Um, my life's pretty busy and if I'm going to invest time and money into playing into Q school, I've got to prepare for it. We've got four or five months, where are we now? Q schools played at the beginning of May. We've got about five months to prepare. So we've got we've got enough time. I'm gonna set myself one goal for today. And that goal is to do the lineup and clear the table in the basic lineup. Doesn't matter how many attempts, doesn't matter how many times I missed the first red or I missed the black on 16. I'm not leaving until I've cleared the table. I could be there a while. I'm a bit nervous about this actually. I haven't thought about parking. I haven't thought about what time I've got to get the kids. I don't think I thought this through. Fingers crossed I'd do it.
So there you go. Luckily, I did manage to do it, but was it my first attempt? Of course it wasn't. I wish it was, but trust me, there was plenty of these. Like I said, I've had a break. I'm just gonna gradually make the targets harder and harder, and make the goals harder. So thanks for watching anyway, and I'll catch you again next time.